Welcome to part 9, identifying the local player. Okay, so I'll write a new Unity method here, public override void on start local player. So this method only runs on, on the local player. So if you have a server and clients connected, it doesn't run on the server, it doesn't run on any of the uh, on the any of the player instances that aren't under your control only your one does this method run on and to uh, I guess make it really obvious which player is ours it will give it a different color so we'll say get component mesh renderer dot material dot color is equal to color dot blue okay and let's go ahead and try that out. So build and run. So now when we host a game, we can see we're blue. Let's connect with a client. And there you go. Ours is blue, and but in the client's view, we're white. And their player is blue. So they control theirs, we control ours, and it's really obvious what we own. So there we go. Nice and simple. All right, so next video, we'll move on to shooting.